Hey everyone, I am Bruce, and today I am going to explain to you how to create Stripe payment links. First of all, open up your Stripe account dashboard. Once you get into your Stripe account, navigate to the More menu and find the Payment Links feature under Direct Payments. Once you click on Payment Links, you will find a clean interface to create a new link. The confirmation page is customizable, offering options to include your company name and a personalized message. Creating a product is easy, with the option to add images and specify whether it is a one-time or recurring payment. You can also set your after payment page from here, which will show you the confirmation page of your payment. So hit the option, replace the default with a custom message. Then you can enter your payment confirmation description as DM me with your email, or you can enter anything here. If you want the confirmation page, you can hit the option, don't show confirmation page, and you can redirect customers to your website. So get back to the payment page and you can add products from here. You can edit your product from here, or you can add a new product. To add a new product, you need to enter its name, description, and price. Also, you can add more currencies such as recurring or one-time. Now click to upload the image of your new product, once you are done with everything, click to add product, and then you can have a preview of your product. If you want to give the authority to your customer to adjust the quantity of the product, simply turn on the option, let customers adjust quantity. For subscription products, you can set billing intervals. It is also possible to collect additional information like addresses and phone numbers. You can include a free trial if you want. After setting up your product, choose a confirmation page and create the link. Then copy the link provided and you are ready to share it with potential customers. If you're exclusively using Stripe, consider configuring email notifications for successful payments in your settings. If you found this guide helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Until next time, goodbye.